Hey everybody, this is David at Barnyard Bees. I want to show you something here. Uh, see if you can figure it out really quick. Uh, the queen was on this frame here. I left my phone up in the house so I had to go get it to film. Okay, there's the queen. Right there. On the front of this box was a bunch of bees and it was clustered around this feeder and and I was going to see if anyone could tell me or not whether there's a queen in it and if there's a queen in it where is she in this bunch of bees right here You see on the side of the box? Or could she be possibly be in this little golf ball size ball right here? It's, it's, it's a dead giveaway. Anytime you see this, you can about it rest assured that there's a queen in there. Now whether they're killing the queen or protecting the queen is a different story. But we're about to find out. I can see her. Right there she is. At this point I'm just trying to determine whether they're trying to kill her or trying to protect her. Sometimes it's hard to tell because the ball can be uh, protecting the bee or it can be killing the bee. They're a little bit too aggr aggressive acting to be protecting the queen. See this bee right here? Now, I've seen this video. I've talked about this in the previous videos. If you can see that bee right there with, with, with her abdomen turned downward, and they're they're moving quite aggressively. They're definitely trying to kill this queen. Okay. So let me put her in the cage, and I'll be right back. Okay, I put her in the cage because they was definitely trying to kill her. So uh, I'm I'm really not sure what happened. It may have been a pocket swarm. She might have possibly been a returning queen. I made the queen return to the wrong hive and they could have been balling her because she was on the outside of the hive. Um, she may have just returned this morning because I just had walked by here and I didn't see it earlier within the last half hour but, but then I noticed it. So it's possible she could be a returning mated queen going into the wrong box. That happens. And uh, because sometimes they get confused of which box they need to, when you have this many boxes and you have a queenless colony and she comes back sometimes they go into the wrong box so what i'm going to do i'm going to put a cork on each end and i'm going to put some of some of these foragers that was trying to kill her in the cage with her and i want to show you how they act okay i'm back um, the reason I'm doing this, I just want to demonstrate how how bees, how their attitude can change really quick. Now, these are the same bees that was trying to kill her not two minutes ago. But putting them in a cage within with that queen, they have completely changed their attitude and they're no longer trying to kill that queen. They're confused, the bees are confused. When, when, when you put queens in a cage, it changes their attitude completely. And 
they will no longer try to kill this queen. If you just watch them there a couple minutes and there's one actually trying to feed her through her mouth to hers. You won't, you will no longer see them trying to ball that queen. They're mouth to mouth right now, and that worker is is feeding that queen. I hope you can see this on the video. The same bees that was trying to kill her are now nurturing her and taking up for her. It's amazing how you can change the bee's attitude by changing their environment. Look at that. She is feeding that queen. No aggression. I hope this shows up. I can see it. Looking over the phone, I can see it, but I don't know if the... If the if the camera's picking it up or not, I hope it is. This queen will do fine with it. I put six foragers in here. I caught them from that same mess of bees right there that was trying to kill her that had her in a ball. So, I will take that queen and introduce her into another colony and I would almost guarantee that she flew back and went into the wrong hive. And it happens. When you got this many boxes, it can happen very easily. But I just wanted to share that. I thought that was very interesting for people that, that is trying to study queens and understand queens. Um, anytime I see something interesting like that, that I've not got to share with people I, I take advantage and share it so people can see it but that's about it don't forget click on the little bell like and subscribe thanks for watching barnyard bees